is, even though this bus is lit up like a Christmas tree, people are still running our stop arms. It's a widespread problem here in Ohio. People driving right past stop school buses, putting children in danger. And now one Northeast Ohio school district says a new law will make the problem worse. Starting July 1st, Ohio drivers are no longer required to have a front license plate on their vehicles. Our Five on Your Side investigator Joe Paganakis explains why local school officials say saving the front plate is a matter of safety. Well, the Parma School is the second biggest district in Cuyahoga County in unanimous support of saving the front license plate here in the state of Ohio, especially because more than five drivers every school day blow past this lit stop sign placard. It's really important that we get a description of, of the vehicle, the person, license plates. Parma School bus driver Somi Ramos knows firsthand how many Ohio drivers blow through stop sign arms. News 5 showing you careless driver after driver on bus video in major cities like Bay Village and Mentor, endangering children, ignoring the bus stop signs. I kind of take a mental mode of that front plate before I get up to, to unload kids. Somi says bus drivers often depend on getting a front license plate number to identify delinquent drivers, that not all districts have street video camera surveillance on their buses to catch those running stop signs. We've had more fatalities at, at school bus stops from passing motorists than we have in, in the past three years than we have in 20 years. Palmer School leaders believe when Ohio eliminates its front plate license requirement in July, it will reduce enforcement, further putting school children at risk. You know, if we have less of a tool to get people convicted, that rate just keeps going up. State Senator Jay Hottinger is now co-sponsoring Senate Bill 179, which would call to continue to require a front license plate on all Ohio vehicles, citing stats from the Ohio School Board Association that found up to 4,500 Ohio buses have drivers illegally passing them each school day. That maintaining Ohio's front license plate is one sure way to continue to fight back against a growing safety issue. It's not only about the safety of our students, but the general public. You know, this helps with amber alerts, with silver alerts. You know, identifying vehicles is, is a huge thing. And the Parma School District encouraging its parents to come out in support of Senate Bill 179 by contacting their state representative or state senator. Senator Hottinger, meanwhile, hopes to have the bill up for a vote as soon as possible. Reporting here in Parma, I'm Five on Your Side investigator Joe Paganakis.